I'm Bree from PJ Flowers. Uh, like Brandy said, we're a small studio here in Phoenix, but are open to traveling um, a lot of places. Um, so just thought we'd show you kind of a quick little slideshow of some things we do and some questions that were asked um, at the studio quite regularly. So uh, number one question we are asked right now, do you work with succulents? Yes, we do. They're very popular. We use them a lot. Um, so if that's a look you're looking for or want them incorporated in anything, we're all about it. Um, great look, especially here in Arizona, but 100% do work with succulents. So happy to help you with that. Uh, and you can hit the next one. Um, we also really love doing some unique looks. So not necessarily your traditional bridal bouquets. We really love making things custom to couples and are open to trying new things and doing new ideas. So this is kind of an example of that. Um, just a totally different styled bouquet, also including succulents. Um, but just keep your mind open and, and think of some new and different things. It's something we definitely encourage. Um, so here's kind of an example. We really love bespoke custom things that are special to the couple. So this is actually a really cool wedding that we did with Brandy um, and incorporated some things that were special to the groom in this instance. Um, so really love Van Halen and Guns N' Roses. So have a Van Halen guitar pick in there, have his Guns N' Roses pendant. Very cool, just something super special that isn't something everyone else is gonna have. Uh, so we really love that. Um, another thing we see a lot right now, garlands people love this lush greenery look um so we get a lot of people contacting us saying things like we just want greenery <laughs> and i don't love hearing that because people think greenery not a bloom it's not going to be expensive and they're going to save a lot of money not true greenery especially right now is super expensive um these looks are very popular, which has increased it. And we're also in the middle of a flower and foliage shortage, thanks to COVID. Uh, so all of these things are a lot more expensive, um, but great, lush, lovely look. Just know if you ask for just greenery and a lot of garland, it is quite pricey. So I'm not trying to discourage anyone from it, but giving heads up. So along with that, we've also seen an uptick in quite large wedding parties uh, recently. We've gotten a lot of requests for like nine and 10 bridesmaids, which great if you have all your friends, you want to have them, know that it will increase your budget significantly. So if you really want all the girls up there, great. Um, if you don't necessarily have the budget for it and these big lush bouquets like in the picture, uh, we can definitely give you other options or do single blooms, but Please just know the more people you have, the more expensive these things are going to be. So it might eat up a huge chunk of your budget. But it's a great look. Everyone loves this shot. Um, Cascade bouquets making a huge comeback. Um, a trend we love, something unique and different. This specific one, the theme of the wedding was heirloom tomatoes, which was very cool. Love a unique theme. Um, so we created this gorgeous bouquet, the beautiful peonies, but then incorporated some of those elements to, to pull in her theme. Um, so really love, like I said, custom things like that. Uh, this bouquet is as large as it appears. It took up most of this woman's body. And again, the succulents, um, her, her big thing was she just wanted huge. She bought specifically this very plain dress so her flowers would show. Um, if you are interested in something like this, Lift your weights, that thing weighed about 16 pounds. So she had to carry it most of the day, um, but she loved it, was prepared for it. Um, and it's just a really cool, fun look that, that we loved. And it's fun to make a giant bouquet. So just know anything large is gonna be more expensive. Um, and this is just something a little bit different, textural, really bright and colorful. This is a great look, especially in Arizona. All these like hot desert colors and a ton of texture. Um, so just something a little different if you wanna get outside of a lot of the blushes and tons of eucalyptus that we've been seeing a lot of. If you wanna do something different, just keep an open mind and don't think that wedding colors are one specific palette. So tons of options. People like me are here to help you. Um, the PJ's team loves working with, with our couples and making everything perfect for your day specifically. So reach out if you have any questions. I do have to leave today, but um, our 
email is up there, our phone number. Please get in touch if you want to set up an email consultation or a Zoom meeting. We'd love to chat.